These events took place in the 1600s. The characters in this movie were inspired by real people during the English Revolution. Also, the scenes in the movie portrayed real-life events in the English Revolution. My fellow Englishmen, I, James VI of Scotland, hereby declare my rule as divine right from Jesus Christ himself. Can I get an amen? Amen. I call upon Parliament. I've called upon thee, the Parliament, to furthermore discuss my urgent topic of my rule by divine right. Divine right? Divine right? Yes, divine right! That's absurd! It is not! That is absurd! It is not! Silence! You're dismissed! Prince, I'm sorry to say what your father has died in combat in defending his country of England. And as a token of his death, I'd like to give you the sword that he fought with. You are now the king of England. <laughs> I, Charles I, heir to James I, the King of England, I will withhold divine right. Yes, yes, I call upon Parliament. I call on you to ask for more money. More money? Ah! Only on these conditions. Number one, all taxes passed by you must go by the parliament or they are illegal. Also, you must set up regular meetings of parliament. Fine, as long as I'm getting my money. Oh, you are, sir. What is this? It is the petition of rights, sir. It states that you cannot pass tax laws without parliament's consent. You also cannot declare martial law. And you cannot put anyone in prison just because you want them to. And prisoners must have the rights of habeas corpus. I can read you full. Just sign it. Fine. I will. Be dismissed.
Sir Charles I, you are hereby committed high treason against the crown and shall now be put to death. Position, and I will work my magic with my hands. First, we must bleed you, my lord. Whip up your shirt. Come in. Sir, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling much better. 100%, sir. Great. Let us continue the operation and hope for a full recovery. King James, we have some laws for you to pass. I have decided that I do not need Parliament anymore. You are dismissed! What? 